Hey, everybody. everybody. Two boys, one brain cell. My name's Chuck Beeson, and this is Joel Norton. Yeah. Today, we're reacting to Ouroboros by Gojira. The Way of All Flesh is the album. That's that scary. This is off of. It is. Have you ever heard of Gojira? No. I have heard of them. I have listened to a few songs. I don't know if this is... I am personally not a giant fan. This is old, Gojira. I don't know if I've heard of this or not. How old's old? Uh, 2008. Okay. Older, Gojira, I guess. I think I had heard some stuff off 2012 album. But, uh, yeah. Let's jump in and see what happens, bud. All right, sounds good. All right, I'm sending it. Shout out to the Patreon. Halfway point. Okay. Well, the intro wasn't that long, and I was already bored. Uh, <laughs> let's just open up with that. Let's let's, let's get that out of the way. I feel you. <laughs> then the vocals hit, and um, they're different. So I don't mind the vocals, but it's a little bit more like towards what I grew up listening to, like out of the metal scene. Yeah. And I don't know, I just don't really dig that sound a whole lot anymore. Yeah, I like the way it just started, like, the vocals that just hit. I like those better, but... I actually I like know. the I like the grittier, the actual kind of screaming. Yeah. But, like I said, it, it kind of reminds me of what I grew up on. Not that it's bad, but it's kind of, I'm out of that space of my life, I guess. Yeah. It's really hard for me to get back in, like, thrash metal. When it, that's what I grew up listening to. Right. Um, and... Yeah, the instrumental, um, that's actually my issue with these guys. They're really heavily, like, heavy with the instrumentals. Yeah. And uh, 
it's kind of a turn off for me being a lyric guy. Dude, the guitar and bass in this song. Yeah. They're going nuts. Oh yeah, absolutely. That's why I said if you're an instrumental person, like you you're gonna love this. Oh yeah. Unfortunately. We're both lyric guys. There's that one brain cell. Followed right? up with what's after lyrics for you? Horns. Oh, okay. Vocals for me. I forgot about your horns. Horns. Third? Vocals. Okay. Interesting. Unless you can fit a random bell or a whistle in there. <laughs> you do like your random instruments, don't I you? I do. Yeah, you're a sucker for those. Hit me with a triangle one time. I I feel like you wouldn't even notice. You're probably right. Like the ding, ding, ding. Yeah, you're probably I right. I don't know. But let's, let's finish, finish it. it up. Kind of give me corn vibes. Don't look at me like that. He's being awful sassy today. So what do you think, bud? Me sassy, no way. And they got awfully um <clears throat> oh, what's the word for it? Wow, my brain just shut down hard. Okay. Do you want me to help you? Yes. So I'll just jump into what I was feeling yeah. while you're over there contemplating your life. Wow. Um <laughs> so yeah, once it hit that Ouroboros area there, symbol yeah. of eternal life, that Sounded an awful lot like corn to me. Okay. Just hinting of it. You know what I mean? Like yeah. the vocal melody kind of. Yeah. Um, but actually wasn't, you know, that didn't really bother me. Just pointing that out. To me. Um, in general though, I feel like this was a little bit tighter packed with the vocals and less spaces in between, which is, yeah. you know, like I don't mind a guitar solo here or there, or, but, right. but really there wasn't a whole lot of, uh, even the in-between, there it was just kind of like, almost like ambient noise. Yeah, I wasn't a fan of the in-betweens. Yeah, it wasn't. Or the intro. There wasn't a whole lot of interesting bits there for me. Right. Um, they weren't so, like true solos. They tried to get atmospheric with those parts. Atmospheric, yeah. That's the word I was trying to come up with because they got really atmospheric there in the second part. Oh, this is getting bad. And you I liked even, it. You can't even think about it. atmosphere. Oh, boy. Um, brain shut down. Yeah. So I think if it was tighter packed for me, yeah. I'd probably enjoy it a little bit more, but it's just, uh, yeah. Yeah. I like the atmospheric nature of it there in the back, back end of the song. But other than that, I was not, 
I was not a big fan of the song. I think vocally is probably my favorite aspect of it. And like I said, it parts of it were a little too close to some of that earlier metal I grew up listening to. And uh, like I said, I'm just not really into it anymore. Um, but then there at the end, I really like that the melody how they had that uh, almost like layered a little bit. Yes. And uh, like I said, it gave me some corn vibes, but not too much to be like corn. Yeah. So that was nice. I would say vocally between just before that halfway mark we hit through the end, I was very happy with the vocals. Yeah. I don't understand the lyrics. <clears throat> and we did get atmospheric. Those are the things that definitely brought the song up. They brought because- it up for you? Yeah. Okay. Because I was not not a fan before that. Gotcha. Um, so I'll let you rate first. Okay. I'm going to go with a 4.1, and it's not going to go in a playlist. All right. I'm going with a flat five here, not going to go in a playlist as well. Um, Again, like I said, it just, uh, I don't know. I it, really didn't do it for me. Didn't do it for yeah. me. My big thing was I really didn't like that intro. I really didn't like the uh, ambient noises. In the gaps, was not a fan of those. And then the lyrics, the vocals at the beginning threw me for a loop, and I wasn't a big fan. Mm, All right. That is all. All right. Well, shout out to our Patreon. At least try to get us out of our uh, comfort zone. Comfort zone. This one did it, I'd say for sure. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Especially for you. (laughs) Big time. But uh, we do appreciate it. And uh, anything else you want to add at all? That's all I got. Guys, we're two boys. We have one brain cell. I'm Joel Norton. That's Charles Beast on my left. You guys can check down our in our description for our social links. And uh, other than that, do us a favor. Hit that like button. And you can go ahead and vote down in the comments on who gets the brain cell. Yeah, you might as well. Yours, get it off your chest. Get some, you know, get some venting. Send it over to Joel because I forgot words. That was a rather easy word, too. I know. That's the worst part. It's embarrassing. It's okay. You got my vote this time. Yay. (laughs) All right, guys. Until next time, a peace out. Peace.